Butterfly Candy. Today I'm going to be reviewing some Barbie stuff. So the first thing is this cute little cat inspired accessory pack. A cute little Barbie doll. A toilet set. <laughs> this is a bathroom set. It's called Dream Bathroom. And the dinner date set, which has a cute little table for your Barbie dolls. So let's get into it. I'm gonna start with this adorable cat accessories. I had to get this as soon as I saw this. Look at how cute that is. Oh my gosh. So here is the little Barbie purse. It has a cute little cat on it and it has cute little cat ears and kind of like a little bow but it looks like crystals. Isn't she adorable? So cute. Okay, then it comes with these adorable shoes which also have some cat detailing on them. It also comes with some black flats and these I do not believe have any cat detailing on them. And then it has a cat necklace. And it even comes with this adorable headband with cat ears. Isn't that cool? So your Barbie can be a cat. And it also comes with this really small bracelet that has a cat on it as well. So small. All right, so that is the accessory pack that I got, and I believe they're about $3, and they're by Barbie. The next thing I'm going to open is this dinner date, and it says it includes a table, two chairs, flowers, two plates, two cups, and utensils. Here is the side of the box, and here is the back. It looks like Ken and Barbie are having spaghetti tonight, but without any sauce. Should we open it up, Riley, and take a peek? This set was about $10, I believe, or maybe it's a little under $10. Here is the spaghetti. Here are the cups. You get two forks. The table has placemats engraved in it and holes for the bouquet, the pasta, and the cups. I really like the chairs, but for under $10, this set is really cute. This set was also under $10 at my local Toys R Us. It has a sink, a toilet, a bath towel, toothbrush, toothpaste, and slippers. Here is the back of the box. Let's open it up and see more detail. And it's a pink bottom. I think I'm going to spray paint the bottom of it because I am not a fan of pink. 
Well, I like pink to a certain extent, but I just think Barbie just overdoes it. So I try to change anything that's pink into a different color when it's for my Barbie dolls. I'm weird like that. All right, so here is the towel. And I'm just gonna put it over here like so. But it doesn't really work very well. Oh, that is a terrible towel. Anyways, it does come with a towel that doesn't look quite right. Here are the slippers. These are pretty cute. And a toothpaste that says, I think Barbie on it. Yep, it says Barbie on it. And a toothbrush. All right, so that is the toilet set. Also called the Dream Bathroom by Barbie. This is just one piece, which is nice. Nothing to really lose. The button is up on top, but I think it's pretty well made for a Barbie toilet. All right, just one more thing to unbox, and that is... Dun, 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 dun. Barbie doll! I liked her because she had a really sweet face and I loved the articulation that I was seeing. So let's get her unboxed. So I was really, really excited to see a Barbie that is really fairly um, cheap. I think she was only like $7, but actually has articulation. Usually um, all of the economy dolls are kind of stuck with like one arm bent and then one straight arm but this is how I think all Barbies pretty much come when you get like the ones with the bathing suit on um, her legs are like a very thin hollow plastic and it's a very hard plastic um, no underwear on this doll except for the printed one on the plastic. Um, it is a one-piece dress. It's actually quite a cute dress. She does have a necklace on. Her head has good articulation. She has beautiful brown hair. It's super soft. Not a whole lot of gel, surprisingly kind of a mess though. Her curls didn't really hold very well, um, but that's easy to fix. And she does have really nice articulation in the arm. She has elbow joint, she has a wrist joint, and her shoulder moves quite well. So she can do many adorable poses. Aww. But as you can see, I'll give you some close-ups. There is some issues with the plastic, um, but I'm just excited to see articulation in her so that she can move about and pose about. And her legs, I didn't think they had any articulation, but as you notice, she can like kind of cross her feet when she's standing. Um, there is no bend to her knee whatsoever. But she, she is able to do some movement with her leg. Like she can kick pretty high. So overall, um, she's definitely showing um, signs of why she is an economy doll. I think I paid like $6.50 for her. But she does have articulation. So there's that. She also comes with a cute little purse. Well, thank you so much for watching, and I really hope you liked this unboxing of fabulous Barbie items and Barbie doll, and I hope you take care. Bye! Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and share this video if you liked it.